Churchill Downs is a familiar image in Kentucky, and Evan Williams Single Barrel is the only vintage dated bourbon. It's becoming more and more of a familiar image with bourbon lovers worldwide. With this event, as you can see, the horses are racing behind me, much like all these people coming in the door, as you see, are racing to get their chance to try. One of the first sips of Evan Williams Single Barrel Vintage 2001. So, Heaven Hill is the largest family-owned distilled spirits producer in the United States. Absolutely. And we've been in business now for 75 plus years. That's a long time for a business to exist here in the United States. But it's a matter of teamwork. It's a matter of everyone understanding what the objectives are. And our objective is to produce the finest bourbons that we can possibly produce. We're continuing to experiment. We make fine, outstanding, unusual, unique, out of the ordinary products. Uh, but have we reached perfection? I don't know that. You know, we're always looking to better ourselves day in and day out. It's a bit of an art to make fine bourbon. What's it like growing up in a family where there's bourbon, there's great spirits all around? I mean, that must be fun. Well, for us, you know, it's, it's more the dynamic of a family business in general. You know, when it's your family's business, it's just a whole different level of passion and commitment to your work. Your work is your life, and it's part of your family DNA. Um, so it's a different paradigm than people who have a regular job. It's the family memories that are passed down with each generation, which make great business and bourbon. So uh, you look at all the other companies and all the other distillers out there, both big and small, the difference is that now they may have to make answer to Wall Street or, or the bottom line. We can just argue amongst ourselves on Saturday or Sunday when we're all together. That's the only people that need to complain. You know what? I think when we did our first vintage preview, maybe five, six years ago, um, we had a group of people here. It was the first time we'd ever done this, and we had no idea if we were going to get 25 people to come to this event or 250 people or whatever. Today we have about 600 people here. Um, but when the people who came that first year, as we were tasting the vintage for the year, came up afterwards and wanted my dad and Parker and Craig's autographs, you knew that we were doing something pretty special. You know, for us, you know, it is our family, it's our passion, it's our job, but autographs, I mean, these people really are so passionate about their whiskey and to be able to deliver that kind of um, great product to people is a pretty special thing. I have not tasted it. They have not let me taste it. They have not let me approve it. I, but in fact, they're the ones who approve it. You haven't approved it yet. They... I, I have not approved it. That is their job. They are the masters. They understand what they're supposed to do, and they have delivered time in and time out over the course of so many years. Have you tasted it yet? Oops. The 14th year, 1986 was the first one, which was released in 1996. The 14th year of Evan Williams Single Barrel Vintage Dated Bourbon, the only vintage dated bourbon in the world. This is really a, an amazing bourbon. What do you think will happen with this? I mean, this is one of the best bourbons in the world always. I would feel really good about having some more awards. And he's thiefing it, which, what does it mean to thief bourbon? Oh, that's just more or less Stealing from the barrel. <laughs> I don't want it to go to waste. Yeah. So I'm here with bourbonblog.com mixologist Stephen Dennison, and we like to do raw tastings, don't we? Yes, sir. Thank you. Now with the 2001, what I'm getting is off of the cooperage, off the nose, I'm getting a lot of corn, um, you know, a little bit of spice, but you know, a lot of that oak right off the nose. This is the hand of the master distiller. This is part of what they do that is quite exceptional. It really shows itself in the end product. We're bringing a culture, a people, and a passion together with one blog. We only encourage responsible drinking by those who have legal age to drink in their countries or regions. So be safe, be legal, and never drink and drive.